I'm Daniel Roseberry. I'm from Plano, Texas, which is right next to Dallas. Um, I moved to Paris 10 months ago, and I've just finished my second couture collection. Caparelli is this incredibly magical world where everything feels possible. The mission of this brand is really to inspire people. Caparelli is one of the most influential brands of the 20th century. And what I love about it is that it was really a house about ideas before a house about making beautiful clothes, pushing the boundaries of fashion and doing things that felt interesting, not just beautiful. I think the main challenge with Scaparelli is that you know, you want to respect the heritage, you want to respect her contribution, you want to respect the codes of the house, but we also have to bring it forward. My creative process really begins with drawing. You know, I've been drawing since I was a little boy. It's always been the thing I've been most fluent in. So after the sketching process is done, I go right into the computer. I open up the computer and I start to do these digital collage. And things happen on the computer screen that would never happen on the page. And I think it's the chemistry between the sketches and the collage that really have enriched the creative process so much. And then from there, I bring the team in. We have to see the clean silhouette from the front, and all the volume can be pushed towards the back. Daniel has a very, very specific way of working. Everything is moving all the time. I think the idea is that it's a little unfinished. And it's kind of a ping pong relationship that he has with everyone that he has with me, but he also has with the atelier and all the rest of, um, of the studio. You know, I know the members of the atelier now more, so if there's a, a dress or a jacket or a trouser, we can say, okay, that's Alan's jacket or that's you know, Brigitte's coat, or that's Hanan's dress, or that's Christian's gown, or that, you know, there's a real individual exchange between me, the sketch, and the person who's going to take the sketch and then carry it into form. And I think that's what's so amazing about couture is that you have one person, typically, who is owning one piece. And I love that idea, too, and I think that that's something that you only get from couture. He wants the design to be as best as possible, so if the idea is not working, let's move on to another idea. And that's really interesting because we always are in movement, so I think it's really inspiring for everyone. Sa vision de Scaparelli est complètement différente. Et ça m'a 
énormément enthousiasmée parce que j'ai senti qu'il voulait ancrer ça dans le contemporain. It's been a real joy to win these people over to this new vision and they were, to their credit, completely ready to follow me. We really swing the gates open for people to see what the creative process looks like, what the fittings look like, what the conversations look like, um, what my process looks like, what the, the trials, the tribulations, and, and the joys look like. And I think that when you look at the Instagram, it's the most accurate way that you can kind of experience what we're doing here. We, I wanted it to feel like it's just this, you can feel the energy, you can feel how many things are happening here. People will feel more excited about being a part of that process with me than me telling them this is what it is. You know, it's only been 10 months, and when I look at what we've been able to accomplish, I think it's pretty impressive. At the same time, I just want more. Old question of what happens when all your dreams come true. And I, the only thing I know what to do is to make new dreams. So yeah, we're just getting started.